Hello folks, Blues Boy Jack here with yet another cigar box guitar. Fat Bottom Betty. This is a very popular brand of cigar because I've picked up a whole bunch of these boxes. These are all used boxes, all real cigar boxes. I get them at the local cigar shops. This one has the fancy gold corners sound hole, so it's acoustic electric. Signed, numbered, got a little L bracket here to stabilize the neck. This also allows you to raise the strings just a little bit or lower them just a little bit. Basically, that's your fine tuning of the string height. Now, a couple things. That's an old school bolt for a bridge, and y'all are like, bolt? Huh? Bolt? Bolt for bolt? What? I've been using bolts for bridge over 17 years. Never had a complaint. It's old school style, folks. Wrap the strings around the screws on the rear. When you change the screw, change the strings, you leave the screws in, cut the strings off, put new strings on. It takes um, three minutes to put a new set of strings on. Anyhow, uh, Bolts give you a really good tone because I got metal on metal, right? So it's going to have a brighter tone. It's not going to be super bright. It's not going to be super dull. It's going to be right in the middle. And your EQ right up the middle will make it sound perfect. If you want even more treble, obviously turn crank up your EQ. Bolts for bridge, folks. Over 4,000 bolts for bridges. Those three screws are the pull pieces of the pickup. The pickup is embedded in the box in order to preserve the artwork. Keep in mind, the sound hole is small, why? The neck goes through to about here, so I can't put a sound hole here. The other reason is, it's a small box, right? It's not a very big box. Not a very tall box either. Which means you don't need a big honking sound hole to get a good honking acoustic sound. Now, these are smaller boxes, obviously, than a regular acoustic guitar, so it's never going to be as loud as a real acoustic guitar. So when you're playing at home or maybe going camping and you don't want to be playing too loud at 3 o'clock in the morning when you're out there drinking, here you go, folks. Again, the L bracket here raises or lowers the neck a tiny bit, mm, just a little bit. What that does is it raises the strings or lowers the strings just a tiny bit according to your preference. So if you want them a little bit higher for slide, go for it. You want them a lot higher for slide, go for it. You want them real low so you can get that spanky tone. Go for it. This is a three string cigar box guitar. This is the A string of a regular six string set or the fifth string, same thing. This is your four or D string and this is your three or G string. Five, four, three config. This is a three string tuned to G. Why? If you can tune it a trillion, billion, trillion, billion times, a billion times, 0.05 percentage divided by 358,000.1 plus 2 minus 3 plus 16. Lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of ways to tune these. Most people tune them to G. Why? Not sure. That's just kind of how it turned out. When CBGs kind of took off on the internet, everybody thought, G, it's got, it's got to be G. Doesn't have to be, but... Since most people promote theirs as G, and most people say that G is the tuning, then therefore most customers and newbies expect it to be G. Doesn't have to be, but that's just kind of how it turned out. So you can tune it a million trillion different ways. You can you don't have to use the five four three strings. You can do four three two. You can do blah, blah, blah. any kind of config as far as strings. Mm -hmm. Any kind of tuning. Sky's the limit. People do three strings all tuned the same. Why not? Sometimes they put a big old honking bass string, like a six string on here, tune it down to D. The next one could be another D, right? Could be another D. So you have a low D, a middle D, and a high G. I mean, there's just a trillion, 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 never ending number of ways to tune. Once again, thanks for watching and thanks for your kind support and toodles.